comic, it's his first time, please show some love for Lucas Ayala. Is that all right? Much love, Coco, thank you. Oh, thank you. Yeah, yeah, I'm a sexy dressed bastard, yeah, I know. In my mind. So anyway, hey, can I get a ding? Because I want to start with that one, it's fun now. Alright, thank you. Bacterial infections. <laughs> Jackie, I think someone's talking about you. Yeah. Yeah. All right, all right. Speaking about girls with bacterial infections, Jackie, but um, anyway, uh, dildo shakes don't give you bacterial infections. <laughs> they clean them out. <laughs> Yeah, speaking about girls, um, let me get this off here. Thank you. My sister is pregnant with her first child. You know. No, thank you. Thank you. And I'm freaking the hell out because I don't know how to be uncle. I'm 20 years old. All right. She's 23. There's like a not a big cap difference there. She's gonna have her first kid. She's like six or seven months along. I am just biting my nails down to the root here, wondering. Holy shit! Fucking things are gonna go down here. I mean, I mean, let's just think of it. I mean, shit. I could have done that. I mean, I mean, a lot of people like have kids. Like a lot of teenagers have underage sex, and they just don't like really think about the consequences and all that kind of stuff. But um, you know, my sister's smart. You know, she's she she's a contract employee at the. Kenny Space Center. She's a smart girl. She knows what she's doing. She's going to school to support herself along with the kid. And she's doing that along with the job. So this kid has nothing to complain about when he grows up. Like, uh, oh, you don't know how hard I have it. You don't know you don't know anything. My sister's gonna be all up in this face, like, bitch, when you were when you were in my stomach, I had to support you and myself by going to work and class at night, so you have nothing to complain about! <laughs> yeah, I am really, really <laughs> I doubt about that. Okay. Has anyone ever here, anyone here in the audience, ever heard of the books, or the book, called Fifty Shades of Grey? <laughs> oh, I see a, a couple of people. Wait for the movie. <laughs> Starting Meryl Streep, coming soon to a theater near you. <laughs> you like that voice? Yeah, I, I do tons of them. Oh, hello there. It's Christopher Walken here. I'm just gonna get my coke and lime. Oh, man. Anyway, I first heard about this book when I was hanging out with a couple of friends of mine. And they say, hey, Lucas, you ever heard of this book called Fifty Shades of Grey? Hey, Jack, hey. hey. So I say, what's Fifty Shades of Grey? And he pulls out this book, and I take a look at it. I don't know what it is. I don't read. No. <laughs> so I take it, I read the first couple of chapters, and I just put it down, like, oh, man, you are a pervert. It's her name here. I'm like, give it up. So anyway, like, they, they say it's like this book about like sex stories and everything like that. Like for example, there's this one story, I'm gonna get real graphic here. There's this one story where a girl, she gets slammed up against her wall and just starts, yeah, and she just, oh, oh my god, oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Jackie, once again, I think that was about you, so. <laughs> Jackie Rose, ladies and gentlemen, like a really, really great talented comedian. Okay, hey, can I get another one of those bell things? Let's have one. Oh, first time. Oh, two? Oh, wow, that's fantastic. You see here, folks. Passed out. Passed out. I've never been passed out before. I'm straight edge. I don't do that stuff. <laughs> now let's try another one that's not necessarily so lame. Bad yourself! <laughs> okay, first off, I'm a man. 
not that there's anything wrong with that, but still, I don't necessarily use Vagisil on my manly parts or anything like that. I don't, no, I don't see any ever so fresh feeling. Do you wake up in the morning and never feel that oh so fresh feeling? Try Vagisil. It gets you so, so fresh. <laughs> That's my time, guys. Thank you very much.